Hello lovely people, welcome back to my channel. We are still on the gist from the Palace of Oni of Ife. As it was alleged that Queen Naomi threw out Olori Mariam and Dr. Elizabeth out of her house. From what we are hearing, it was said that she came in from where she went to. And from what we are hearing, it seems as if she bought a new house in Lagos State without any of Ife's knowledge. And from the look of things, we also heard that she is trying everything within her power to make sure that the house in Akure, where she's living, that she will pack out of that place. And this is what we are hearing. So it was alleged that she went to one of her programs only to return back. And it was, according to them, a few minutes after she returned back, she was in her room resting when Olori Mariam and Dr. Lizzie came to the compound. And it was uh, one of his st her staff, her domestic staff, that brought the two inside. And it was said that they were in the sitting room waiting for her. And when she came out from her room where she was resting to see them, she didn't even sit down. She didn't even say welcome. So the first thing she did was, uh -huh, what is it? What do you guys want from me? What are you doing here? Who permitted you into my house? What gave you the audacity to come to my house after all you did to me in that palace? Why is it that you guys don't want me in the palace and you don't even want to live my life alone? So, while she was speaking, uh, or Lori Mariam told her that she brought Elizabeth to her to pay homage. That was why one of the reasons they came and she was as in what? Now you guys are doing this as if she's one of the big mama of Lagos where all these big politicians and all the people came to pay homage to that she doesn't want it. That anything that consigns that palace that she is fed up, that she's not ready for the fiasco anymore, that you guys should live her life alone. That you don't have any right whatsoever to bring Dr. Elizabeth to that family. So Dr. Elizabeth was like... Uh, uh, I've heard a lot about you, and I said I should come to you. I've heard you a good person. You are this, you are that. I, it, uh, it was said that she cut her off, telling her that she's tired of hearing being a good person, that she don't want them here. The let, let today be the last time that she is coming to that house, or uh, Dr. Uh, or Lord Marion that will bring her, or any other woman, to her house. And she also told uh, Dr. Elizabeth that this Mariam that you see here, who claims to come for me, that she doesn't even want me in that palace. She was the one who frustrated, she was one of the person that frustrated me out of that palace. So coming here to pretend as if all is well, she knows her better, that all is not well. She does, she's not kind in any way. And she's also using the opportunity to... Tell Dr. Elizabeth to be careful with Mariam because she is not what she thinks she is. Now that she has entered, very soon she, she's going to serve her breakfast like she has been doing to her, like she did to her and all that. So while we, they were saying all this, uh, Dr. Lizzie said, uh, please, we want to uh, use this some opportunity to tell you that Oni is sick that she is not happy she's this that he is not happy that he is not uh, strong enough you know trying to convince her to talk to him but he says that all this your drama is not going to work it is not going to work i also heard that runke have tried her own best to contact uh, when naomi to talk to oni of ife but it all proved abortive and this time around uh, Naomi said it to them clearly that he doesn't care how he feels or how he doesn't feel. And no, none of them should try to enter that palace again, enter that, uh, his, her residence again. If not, that he is going to do something that they will not like. And when he was, uh, after saying what she wanted to say, 
she now ordered them to leave. And when uh, Mariam asked her, are you, throwing out, are you throwing us out of your house? She said, call it whatever that you want. I don't care. But all I know is go and never return back. Go and don't ever come back. Tell your only of Ife that, tell your husband that I don't care how he feels. I don't care who he brings or him, who he doesn't bring. That she is fed up with this uh, life of pretense. As in where uh, everybody is pretending to love her. Whereas none of them love her. That she's not coming back to that palace. And she uh, let doubt uh, coming there be the le first and the last that she will come to her house. Uh, 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 it's a serious warning of, from her side. As in uh, Mar uh, Mariam. And Elizabeth was very surprised because they thought it was the same Naomi that they knew before who would keep quiet to listen to them or to just be kind to them. But they don't know that. They have pushed her. As in, they have pushed her to a point where she has to act. If not, if, she even said that she regrets ever me, being married to Oni of Ife. That the only good thing that came out of that marriage is... Uh, her son Tadenekawo, that he she always thank God for the gift of that child. But apart from that child, that every that there is nothing good that comes out of that marriage with Oni of Ife, and it's something that she's living to regret. But all the same, it's never too late. The only thing that is that she don't want them in her house. She don't want anything to do with them again. She don't want any form of relationship with them again. They should go and never return. Ha! Huh? No be smart, you know. No be smart in at all, at all. This woman, she's angry. These people have made her angry. Seriously. Because the Queen Naomi that I know or been hearing about is a kind human. As in, she is a very kind woman who will not talk to people like this. But because she's trying to save her life, she's trying to save herself from all this Uni Palace and the co-wives and all that. That is why she went as far as giving it to them. Buzz, buzz, a serious one and never to return. Anyways, guys, I don't know what to think. Another thing that we're hearing is that um, she might be leaving that residence soon to clear everything that concerns Oni and her, his people. Don't forget that all this information are all alleged. It's not a first-hand information. So it should be treated as such. Thank you once again for your support. Please do well to subscribe if you have not subscribed. Like and share my god bless you see you guys in my next video bye for now love you guys